Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you an easy way to install IPTV Smart Earth Pro application to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, we'll have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. So just go to search on your device and here in the search bar, start typing Downloader. Here it is, as you can see, the loader has already popped out for us at the bottom, so there was even no need to enter whole name of the app. We click on the loader, and that's the app which we need to get to our device. However, after we get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. And to stop the loader, we'll go to settings. So here they are, open them, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Open it. Here we'll have to enable developer options on your device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new ones, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, do not worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times. And do it fast. So let's do it. As you can see, now the button for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps, and here find the loader and turn that option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those which are only available in the official Amazon App Store. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now let's go to the list of apps on our device. Here it is, open it. And there is with the loader app, which we just got to our device. However, before actually using the loader, there is one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast. We got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say I am connected to Denmark right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you wish to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you'd like to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your computer or your mobile phone, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to send you to the same amazing deal for NordVPN with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you 3 months of NordVPN for free. And now finally, let's use the loader safely. So we open up the downloader application. On the left side menu, make sure to click on Home, that's important. And then here in that search bar, we'll have to enter a code, which is going to be 2, 8, 9, 0 and 7. So once again, the code is 28907. Make sure to enter it exactly as you see on the screen and do not make any mistakes. Because obviously, if you make any mistake, the code is not going to work. After that, you have to click on Go. And in a couple of seconds, a website is going to open up for us. Now, when the website has finally opened, we have to scroll down a little bit until we see a list of categories. And from the list of categories, we have to click on IPTV players. So let's click on it. Then a pretty big list of apps is going to open up for you and there's the IPTV Smarters Pro app which we're looking for. So we click on it, then probably some kind of ad is going to pop out for you. If it does, do not click on open, instead press on close or on X depending on what kind of ad you see. And after that a new web page should open, yep, here it is, we also have to scroll down. Keep scrolling until you see those download buttons, here it is, let's click on download, but if for some reason it does not work for you, you can always use the backup download link, which is just below the usual download button. So for now, let's click on download and wait until the app gets downloaded to our device, usually it does not take long, but of course it all depends on your connection speed. Here just click on install and wait until IPTV Smarters Pro app gets installed to your Fire Stick, usually it does not take long. So let's wait for a couple of seconds. And after the app is installed, do not click on open yet. Instead, press on done 
because here we'll have an option to delete the installation file, as we don't really need it anymore. So we click on delete and then delete once again. Now finally, let's go to the list of apps on our device. Here it is, open it, scroll to the bottom, and there you'll find the IPTV Smarters app, which we just installed to our Fire Stick. I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote. That's the button of three horizontal lines. Click on it and then press on move to front. This way IPTV Smarters is always going to be at the very top of your application list and it's going to be really easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Then of course don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble online. Once again you can use my link in the pinned comment below or just go to topvpnoffer.com to get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free. After that finally let's open the IPTV Smarters application. Here we just need to select our device option. Since we are using a Fire Stick, it will be TV, so we click on save. And from here, it's really straightforward. If you have a M3U link, which is the most usual option for IPTV or live TV services, you click on that button, then click allow here and add any name to your playlist, then upload it as a file or select this option and enter the link which you got from your service provider. There are thousands of different live TV providers in the world, so it's totally up to you which one to choose. Of course, we only recommend using the official live TV providers. Also, if you have an extreme code instead of M3U link, it's also possible to use it here in the IPTV Smarters Pro application. You would have to select that option. Once again, add any name to your playlist, then add a username, password, and a link. All those details, once again, you get from your service provider. And then all those playlists that you have added are going to appear right here in the list of playlists in IPTV Smarters app. And that's it, that's the easiest way to get and set up IPTV Smarters on your Fire Stick. Make sure to subscribe my channel to see more content like that in the future. And see you next time. Bye bye.